Hey everyone, uh, I'm, I'm going to preemptively apologize. I have tried to make my camera less crunchy, but I, put, I have been packing and I don't have a lot of stuff to stack it on. <laughs> so, we're gonna have crunchy cam when I'm streaming from the couch for a while now. Anyways, we're back to Naruto. I completely forget where we are. I know we're on the second game, and I know that we were playing as Sasuke and his friends. Z. Who are his friends? There, there was the. There was the water guy with the Zabuza sword that wasn't the Zabuza sword. Uh. There was, God. The, the guy who was all about curse marks. And... The girl the girl who was cute, but kind of like in a Yandere way. Also, nice to see you, Useful Walnut and RDF. Jugo is the curse mark dude. Yeah, these guys. Sasuke's mood has changed completely. Karin is the bite girl? Okay. And the other one. That guy in the perf- So, god. Sasuke's crew. Sasuke's the only one that has a cool outfit. Cause like, let's take a look at our, our characters for a sec. Ah, shit, I don't think we can, can we? I can't- yeah, I can't check my members. Well, we got pajamas, we got blue- uh, sorry, purple tank top sweatpants, and we got ki kind of dusty purple- got Jugo juice, get out of the way, please. Okay, actually, you know what? Ka Karin's got, like, that Zetari Yoiki going on. She's an absolute terror with the absolute territory. Uh, you're playing with AI image generators. Toss my username, and that image is in stream context? Since I don't have guests today, I can actually check that. What do we got going on? All right, so what, when I go to make my uh, cover album, that's gonna be my album art, isn't it? <laughs> that's that's actually kind of neat. <laughs> he's around here. The animals told me they saw Itachi nearby. Oh, now he speaks with animals too. Great. We'll split up here and look for Itachi. If you find him, you're not to engage him under any circumstance. I want you to contact me immediately. That's right, he needs to make eggs for us. I know. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya. It won't be long now. Alright. You have an exclamation point. What do you want from me? Okay. Hold, hold on. There's a button I should be able to press, right? <laughs> there we go. I just wasn't close enough. Jigo's really good with animals? For a reason I... Okay. Oh, we're in the dark forest. It's been a long time. Who? It has. It's Who been at least you? two weeks. It's me. Sasuke. Hi. Itachi. Uchiha. You look tall 
taller. You haven't changed at all. Your eyes are still cold. Just... Just hug already. Going up against your brother and using their first last name. Yeah, my brother walked up to me and was like, Ah, yes, Carson Cross. <laughs> I would be like, what, what are you talking about? Hi, can I help you? Why are you at my house? <laughs> Oh, is this the to test my abilities scene? You are not even worth killing. If you want to kill me, then learn to hate me. Hate me and live like the coward you are. Cling to life without honor. Itachi! Why do you gotta be like that to just a little kid? Also, I'm gonna turn down my uh my gain. I'm kinda peeking the microphone. <laughs> there we go. of that night the younger version of me could only comprehend them as a mirage at first i desperately wanted to believe i was trapped in a horrible genjutsu but sasuke just say that tra you were trapped in a horrible dream there was no mistake you don't have to make it sound cooler than it actually was in reality i'm not the boy i was back then now I have the strength to obliterate I'm not you. the little boy that I used to be. I'm all grown up now, Itachi, can't you see? <laughs> what impressive confidence. Right here, right now, I will put an end to uh, When Genjutsu nightmare. is a type of attack you can use, and also a dream, dialogue gets confusing. Okay. Are you ready? Sure, why not? I'm sure muscle memory is gonna take over for me. Go. Oh no, he used bird jutsu! Okay, hold up. How how did I control this? Oh no. Okay, well I I can do that. Oh, uh, can I not use ultimate jutsu? That might be a problem. Oh, hey, look at that. You walked right into my attack. Itachi Uchiha. Okay, one, one of these buttons was... turned into a log. Whoa, how the hell did I do that? Was that my block? Sorry, was that my grab, actually? Oh, your Silver Ranger was really cool. And you just have a couple more to go, so I'm excited to see uh, you complete your collection. There we go. Oh, is this fake Itachi? Are we in a Genjutsu now?
You meant for the in space team? Oh, sorry, my bad. Yeah, those lightning collection figures are really, really good. Honestly, I might pick one up of the selfie collection. Just you imagine the, the Carson head on one of the that. Rangers. I gotta figure out which one I want to be, though. Because I think they're only doing uh, Mighty Morphin. And I would really, really like one from Time Force. Meet me at the Uchiha hideout. Alone. How can there be an Uchiha hideout if the entire clan's dead? We'll settle this there. It, li literally, the Uchiha cl uh, hideout could only have Itachi in it. Or Sasuke. <laughs> hey, Trump. Sasuke. Whoops. You. Why are you here? There we go. Karin spoke of a massive clash of chakra. Yours and another heavy hitters. We got worried and came to check on you. Well, don't get worried about me. You're you're my team, not my mom. Sasuke, what on earth happened? There we go. I found out what was going on. Sorry, my my laptop. Uh, I usually put the uh, the stream manager on there, just so that I can see what's going on. But it was chugging, and it turns out that having Facebook open probably isn't the best thing for my computer's health, because it was using like all of my uh, CPU and my RAM. There we go. We good now. Follow me. We're leaving. The Uchiha hideout. I'll settle everything there. Chapter 5. Brothers. A tale of two sons. We're switching games. I, I have something that I'm really excited to debut. I've only shown it to subscribers, and I've only shown it to my patrons. So, where are you going? Uh, but we're going to- I'm going to be debuting them on Saturday. To the Uchiha hideout. The Uchiha hideout. To settle this once and for all. I, what what kind of hint can I give you besides, like, it's on Saturday? I mean, I guess it has something to do with Stream Sakai, so. Be my guest. The surprise is that they're canon characters in Konosuba now. Congrats, no. I should probably buy some ointment. I think 20 high grade. Oh, but we got top grade ointment now. Yeah, let's get, like, 30 of those. I can afford it. L'Oreal, because I'm worth it. That's what the ointment's made out of. Uh, more or less, this fight has been hinted at and built up since episode 2 of the anime. Show might as well be called Sasuke right now. Okay. Now, uh, what else can I grab? Oh, sorry, what did I skip over? Sluggish tag. Yeah, why not? Later. Okay, actually, Sasuke is not doing so great, is he? <laughs> let's just let's just rub some high grade ointment on him. There we go. We're good now. Is the Uchiha hideout. What are you looking at? Is there something in that direction? Release. Buddy, it's a hideout. You, you didn't think that it would be hidden? Whoa. Didn't expect to find a passage here. 
Also, that was just a rock. Could they not have just gone around the rock? <laughs> oh man, there's a giant boulder over here. And nothing preventing me from going behind the boulder besides some trees and bushes and whatnot. Let's go. Something's coming. <laughs> Hi. Sure. Only Sasuke passes this point. Orders from Itachi. Why don't the rest of you wait here? Hmm? All right. Besides, we were only traveling as a cell in order to prevent interference. You three wait here. Now then, Kisame Hoshigaki. And the broadsword known as shark skin. Hmm? How do you know that? Have you forgotten the younger brother of Mangetsu Hozuki? Sugetsu Hozuki? I sure did. Who the hell is Mangetsu Hozuki? Ah, you sure have grown, Suigetsu. Waiting around for Sasuke to return will be a bit of a bore. Care to play around with me? So, Suigetsu could mean, like, water moon, but I completely forget what Mangetsu means. It, it's something moon, but I, I don't remember what Man means. I, I think Man might actually be, like, 10,000. <laughs> Hold on, let me look this up. All right, there are the characters. Yeah, one of the characters is Moon, but I don't know what the other one is. Let's find out. Oh, I'm dumb. It means full moon. <laughs> You're quite impetuous, unlike your brother. Oh no, it's Moon Moon. <laughs> The, the dumb werewolf. <laughs> of course, if your friends would like to join in, they're more than welcome. <laughs> I want this so bad I can taste it. Let's kick this off already, Master Kisame. It's funny, because, uh, Kisama, you say to somebody if you really don't like them. It, it's, it's like the... You... It's like the version of saying you, where you're also saying you piece of shit. <laughs> so, he's Kisame. Which is one letter off. <laughs> Same means shark. Go! Oh, that's right, I have friends that can help. Oh, wow, he's slow. Oh, that's actually kind of cool, though. Hey, Cotty, give me... Okay, you didn't give me a hand. I get it, you only have eyes for Sasuke. Ah yes, the fuck you got. Yeah. In, in Japanese language, they have like, different ways of saying, like referring to other people that, that are different levels of rudeness. Cause like, you, you use Kimi if you like really, really like them. Uh, and then you use Omae when, you know, you don't like them. Oh god, okay. I think maybe I'm losing this fight.
Guess I need more practice speaking in Japanese. I do. I I didn't practice Japanese all throughout COVID, and I really should have. I should have done that instead of uh, learning how to make cotton blends. Though that being said, I make some bomb ass coffee now. Oh no, you blocked my wave. The shark guy isn't weak against water, guys. Oh jeez, I didn't block enough. Now I'm over here! Oh wow, he just, he didn't even try. Uh, so we get all about those water ninja swords. And two of them are here, the five others are off being useless. Fair. Coffee's amazing. Maybe some groups at my college that practice speaking Japanese together. Uh, it depends. It's gonna be a really small college. Like, as far as I know, I'm the only class. Like, there, there's only one class. I do have all the class. Actually, funny story. In, uh, when I was studying illustration, there were 30 of us, and, you know, it was a pretty big class. But the next year when I was studying animation, there were only two of us, me and Gerard. And there were two teachers, Cody and Megan. So it was a one-to-one -one student teacher ratio. And then Megan left uh, to be, like, a TV animator. So then then it was Cody Gerard and I. You're better than I expected. I'm gonna take that broadsword of yours. Why? Take my shark skin, eh? <laughs> Unfortunately, you still aren't powerful enough for that. What did you say? I haven't gotten serious yet. Oh yeah? Maybe you should do that then. <laughs> I truly wish I could, but sadly, I'm not allowed. Orders from up top. Up top? That's right. I'm a you bottom, you will see. Have to be told someday too. What do you mean? <laughs> Kisame, the whiny bottom of the Naruto universe. Just you. Maybe Itachi to Sasuke is one of those guys where it, it feels weird re uh, referring to him by less than his full name. You know, like Stephen Stills from Scott Pilgrim? If you ever watched the, uh, sorry, if you ever read the manga. Uh, it's not even a manga, it's a comic in manga style. Itachi is in there. I don't know. So... My classification between comics and manga isn't just where it originates, because you can have an American comic in a manga style, right? Uh, I would say that if you have to read it from uh, right to left, I would consider that a manga. That, that's just personal... The time to settle this personally how I do it. Like, there's a Kamen Rider Zero One comic coming out, and that is absolutely going to be a comic. It's going to be read left to right. Am I ready? I saved earlier. Itachi, I'll show you this hatred of mine. All of it. I'm gonna be an angry boy. Oh, we're Samurai Jack now. Walking. Big brother, walking. Could you please help me memories. With today? Walking. I'm busy. 
Why don't you ask father? You're better at shooting Genjutsu. Even I can tell that. He is known as the Zero Tail Beast, so uh, maybe he does get no tail. <laughs> Fair. Why do you always treat me like such a pest. Sasuke. Sorry, Sasuke. Maybe next time. In space, yellow, black, and pink were the only in space rangers, aside from silver, to be sold solo. In space, red and blue were sold in two packs. Okay. That is kind of like a marketing trick, though, where they there are some that you can only buy together just so that they can make extra money. My name is Sasuke Uchiha. Like, uh, plenty of things I hate. there was a pack of Power Ranger and a Ninja Turtle crossover figures. And I, I was considering getting one, but they only came in the two packs. And to be completely honest, I didn't really care about getting... Like, I don't know, Foot Ninja Tommy Oliver, <laughs> so. I think it was Foot Ninja Tommy Oliver and uh, Red Ranger Raphael. It seems pointless to talk about dreams. That's just a word. But what I do have is determination. I plan to restore my clan. And there's someone I have sworn. Okay, but that's a dream, though. You, you might have the determination to realize that, but that is a dream. We can argue semantics all day, Sasuke. Finally. Finally, I made it. So you're here. Hi. Sasuke. I'm going to sever all ties with you. <laughs> you sound quite fired up. When I think that I'll be able to bury you here, power surges up inside me. <laughs> bury me, hmm? Before that, I have one thing to ask. Could you make me sunny side up eggs for the last time? What could you want to know now? That night, the night you destroyed the Uchiha clan, did you really do that alone? Why would you think that? For no matter how good you were, you couldn't have taken down the entire clan. There must have been someone else there that night. <laughs> so you realized. Who was it? Who helped you? Madara Uchiha. Oh! Wait, I remember that from Jump Force. That's the fan guy, right? Madara Uchiha. That, that's the one that they had the copy past of. One of the founders of the Hidden Leaf Village. An immortal man who is both my comrade and my mentor. A founder? Then how could he still be alive? It is the fan guy in the red suit? Madara, okay. He's alive. Whether you want to believe me or not is your choice. Quit joking around. Uh, in space, blue is sold with psycho silver. Uh, sorry, actually, the silver ranger in disguise. And in space, red comes with astronomer, main villain in, in space, and in space, red's sister. Okay. Should have been dead for eighty years. Every single. Uh, I mean, this is Naruto. <laughs> You think the guy in the mask? You mean Toby? However, both knowledge and awareness are equivocal. One's reality. My name is Mara, Mara Uchiha. But I think that name's dumb, and I want a more American sounding name. So I'm gonna go by Toby. But spell it with a, an I at the end. Because that's just how I roll. Trying to say that you thinking Madara is dead is just your arbitrary assumption. Your eyes haven't grasped a single truth. You don't see anything. It's true that I don't know anything about Madara 
In fact, this is the first time I've heard of him. But there's one thing that even my eyes see just fine. <laughs> and what he also see? went through a lot of behavior changes. He was kind of goofy when we met him. Gets the meme sunglasses for that one, yeah. What I'm seeing right now, Itachi, is you dead at my feet. There's a reason for that. Interesting. It, it, is it like old Gothi? Is Toby the old Gothi version of Madara? Oh, really? He did at your feet, hey? Oh, we're in a cutscene. Let's get to it. Oh, this is actually kind of kind of hype. No, my hatred. I picked some. I picked up some tricks from that one fight against Kakuzu. Oh, hey, I, I got something spicier. Oh, he has a blue health bar now. Sorry, I will catch up with the chat when I can, but uh, I don't believe I can re recover health between phases. So if he decides that he's gonna have a spicy attack, I I won't be able to heal up. <laughs> Oh, time for QTEs. Oh, oh no, his mascara is leaking. Oh, that's... That's some crazy mascara. This will be my last jutsu. Oh, don't go Vegeta on us. Let this herald your end. I, I don't think that Harold is his end. I've still got a few stars to go. Done. It's finally over. Is this the death you had imagined for me? <laughs> you really have gotten stronger, Sasuke. Without this, I would have been dead. Now that's a lot. <laughs> the Susano. Susano. Sasuke versus Itachi. Watching out for the movement of the Susano. Focus your attacks on Itachi. Half hearted attacks won't work. Instead, get close and attack over and over until you see the path of victory. Also, I can catch up on the chat. <laughs> uh, more of a DID personality? Okay. Uh, Psycho Silver offers the chance to roleplay up a what if of an actual Psycho Silver appeared before Zane and got into a fight with him. Okay. Uh, eye bleed and blindness is a side effect of using your eye powers too much. After they've upgraded it like Itachi's. Okay. 
Also, I think Gideon messaged me. Oh, I think Gideon's watching Gumball. That's cool. Anyways. Boss fight. What? Okay, Sasuke. Wait, I'm not even allowed to use Chidori. Maybe I should block that. I, I know we don't block in this house, but like... I blocked that. Wow, I'm doing way better at this boss fight than I thought. Like even even though even though I'm getting hit. Maybe I shouldn't have gotten cocky. Uh, no, but you might be. Oh, to the left, to the left. That was, that wasn't to the left. I don't think. Dare you? Oh, jeez. You uh. I can lend you power. You, you feel in the Orochimaru? Rem remember how I was right about Orochimaru being inside you being a bad thing? Orochimaru's eight-headed serpent jutsu. Oh no! It's the stand white snake. He's gonna steal his stand disc. Orochimaru. Finally it emerges. Can I play as Itachi now? Oh, that was a square. <laughs> Ura! Bitch had it coming. Now that I think about it, White Snake is a oh god, he used the Mafuba on him. This is it, Sasuke. And now your eyes are mine. What are you saying? Is there anything I can do? Give up. You lose. Shut up! Joke's on you. This is the Sasuke chapter. You can't hurt me. What should I do? This is... It's no use. My chakra is no use. My chakra is almost... It's no use. My chakra... Okay. 
I'll use a ninja tool. <laughs> Good thing I had one of those. I just walk away. Curse this. Bye. Oh, I can't walk away. My eyes. You are my light. Stay back. Sasuke. Wait. Don't just mouth it, just say it. <laughs> oh, I, I don't like when things happen to eyeballs. And things didn't happen to eyeballs. I guess there's no choice. Why would you You're do something like brother. this? Settle for hating me. You promised to teach me new shuriken jutsu. Sorry, Sasuke. Another time. Big brother, you're so far away. It's just the two of us. I'll always be with you, you know. Jimara gets deep inside. Missing the backflash, but that that's Itachi's I love you gesture. Oh no. Were they gonna hurt Sasuke? I mean That sounds correct in terms of plot. What? I only got 30 out of 36 stars? I guess I didn't ora hard enough. So Itachi was never really evil. Guess not. There's a lot I haven't found out yet. And I'm sure there's a lot that I'm not going to find out by playing these games. I'm calling it now. This is Kabuto. Itachi is dead. You won. That doesn't sound like Kabuto. Never mind. We've met once before. Although we were enemies then. You don't sound like Toby. <laughs> Itachi just felt like killing the whole clan, and he spared his brother for a real good fight like Goku. Hell yeah. Don't worry. I don't hold Daedara's death against you. I'm not your enemy. I brought you here in order to tell you something. Something? Yes. It's about Itachi Uchiha. <laughs> you think you know everything about your brother, but you actually don't. How do you know about Itachi? All right. I suppose I should start by introducing myself. I, like you, am an Uchiha survivor. What? And one of the few who know the truth about your brother. Wait a minute. Why do you only have the Sharingan in one eye? I 
Oz upgrade because he killed Itachi? Okay. What was that? So Itachi is super dead now. That's actually... Huh. I, I thought he'd last a bit longer, to be honest. The Amaterasu, which Itachi seems to have implanted in you. <laughs> Leave it to Itachi to set a post-mortem trap. I can't believe how well he plans ahead. What are you talking about? In order to keep me away from you, Itachi placed a jutsu in you. Hell yeah. He really must have wanted to stop you hearing the truth from my lips. <laughs> what are you talking about? Itachi did something to you before he died. He flicked my forehead. <gasps> At the very end, he transferred his own ocular powers to you. What are you saying? Is there a point to all this? Why would Itachi do such a thing? Don't you get it? <sighs> he was no, I don't. To protect you. Protect me? Are you kidding? He's my enemy. He killed our parents, destroyed our clan, and he. I told you. You think you know about? Hey, your you know, you know how you, you know thought that Itachi was bad, and you swore on your entire life to defeat him. That was based on false information. Sorry, buddy. Shut up. <laughs> Itachi did mention it, did he not? He was not alone that night. <gasps> then you are... That's right. Amadara Uchiha. Hi. I know everything about Itachi. I know what he thought, what he wished, what he loved, and what he risked to fight. I know all of it. False information perpetuated by Itachi? Now that's fair. Is to hear about the truth and life of Itachi Uchiha. It's your obligation. You know, since he killed him and all. He, Itachi fought me. He's tortured me for years. Did he torture you? And it's a fact that he destroyed our clan. He destroyed the Uchiha. And if that were a mission he'd received from the Hidden Leaf Village? <gasps> that's just the beginning of the truth about Itachi. Uh, mission? You said? He grew up without a family or clan? That's I right. mean, I guess. Itachi completed his assignment that night by slaughtering everyone. I feel like that's... a stretch. I could be wrong, though. I personally wouldn't call that torture. I'd, I'd call that he was a really, really big jerk. I still don't no. understand. God, it, it sounds bad when I say it that way. Oh man, this guy killed my family and my clan. What a big jerk. <laughs> it's like oh, something from Four Kids see. Naruto. Ended up being a it's like in Conan the Barbarian, if you walked up to the snake wizard and were like, Oh man, you killed- you killed my mother. You killed my father and beheaded my mother. What a jerk. I pray to Krom to- to kill this jerk. Sacrificial pawn. There we go. That that's four kids. Naruto. The Hidden Leaf Village. I can't forgive Itachi. What a jerk. He killed my parents and all my cousins. Ugh, the meanie! Everyone I had known for ten years? All dead? Gosh, what a bully! It is a large village now, but waves of history churn at its base. I'll never invite him to my birthday party. In particular, discrimination towards the Uchiha. Discrimination towards the Uchiha? For 
Originally, the Hidden Leaf Village was formed by a group of ninja who'd previously been in conflict. Our Uchiha clan was among them. When the Hidden Leaf Village was founded, our clan held central power along with the other clans. Man, Madara but got a haircut. But <laughs> failed to take the seat of the first Hokage, the Uchiha gradually fell from power. I, the Uchiha leader, despaired at our fall, and at last I left the village. After I'd gone, the Uchiha continued to lose power, and finally, they were treated as nuisances in the village. In the end, the Uchiha weren't needed. They were discriminated against. Of course, in fact, there were those who couldn't The Hidden that. Leaf Village were only the real meanies, the real jerks. In order to retake power for the Uchiha, and above all else to regain their pride, they hatched a plan. A plan? To take over the Leaf Village with your father as leader. A coup d'etat, you could say. The Neat. Uchiha clan. A coup d'etat. And my... My father... The Hidden Leaf Village leaders caught wind of the plot and sent in a spy to watch the Uchiha clan. That spy was your older brother, Itachi Uchiha. <laughs> The Uchiha clan or the Hidden Leaf Village. It's hard to imagine what Itachi felt as he chose between them. He ultimately chose the Hidden Leaf Village. Good guy, Itachi. So why? Why would Itachi betray the Uchiha? The Third Great Ninja War. What he saw made Itachi put the peace and stability of the village first. All wars are hell. Do doesn't the war all... Doesn't the war happen, though? The village leaders took advantage of Itachi's feelings and gave him a mission. Was the eradication of the entire Uchiha clan. I, I think he might have missed time, two people. Itachi worried and fretted and agonized. He was mired in terrible distress. Considered rationally. One could never raise his hand against fellow clansmen. But if the Uchiha coup d'etat were to go ahead, the village would crumble and other villages would attack. It could have easily become the trigger for the fourth great ninja war. The selfish act of the Uchiha clan would lead to the deaths of many innocents. That had to be avoided at all costs. That sound, I mean, you know, slaughtering the entire clan might not be the best bet, you know? There could there could have been other people like Itachi who would be like, oh shit, yeah, having a fourth ninja war, probably not a good time. But I guess, you know, it, it's the end the bloodline theory of revenge, where if you, if you do harm against someone and kill a family member, you have to end the bloodline, otherwise someone's going to take revenge against you, you know? You kill someone's brother, the the rest of the family is gonna go against you. So you you just you gotta you gotta kill them all. That way that way no one no one comes to get you. <laughs> and so Itachi made his decision that he himself would can't have a blood feud if you don't have a bloodline. Sasuke, why would he betray the clan? Madara, were you not listening? <laughs> they died as heroes, slaughtered by their own. One bad egg. Which led to not a bad night. bunch. It was a mission to become known as a criminal who murdered his own clan. To bear the burden of disgrace, all planned. It was all part of the mission. Okay, but couldn't the Hokage have been like, Hey guys, so our boy Itachi here slaughtered the entire Chiha clan. By the way, they were going to try and like take over the village. So he's a cool guy. 
Uh, he, he basically prevented all of us from going to war, so he should be a hero. <laughs> Literally, just a bit of explanation would have prevented most of this from happening. <laughs> Itachi brilliantly discharged the plan. His mission, except for a single mistake. Even after he closed his heart and become a demon of destruction, there was one person, just one, whom Itachi could not kill. He wanted his father to be remembered as a hero, his clan as good people? I mean, I guess. <laughs> his brother could never be trusted, another coup could start. A what a one guy coup. His little brother. Afterwards, Itachi appealed to the third Okage, beseeching him to protect you. He fled the village after threatening other leaders never to harm Sasuke. He worried about you above all else. So Itachi died to atone? I guess. I mean, if he did all this, he probably wouldn't have killed Sasuke in that fight. That's a lie. It's got to be a lie. It is the truth. You're lying. He tried to kill me over and over. Hey, remember if all Itachi those times really that he didn't succeed? Kill, <laughs> you would most certainly be dead. And Itachi had a reason to pressure you. Sasuke, you kind of suck, by the way. He was just letting you win this entire time. God, what a slap to the face. Itachi arranged everything about that battle. He wanted to free you of the curse mark and Orochimaru. And by having you defeat him, he wanted to set you up as the hero who avenged the Uchiha clan. So, literally, Itachi did everything to make Sasuke a big deal. <laughs> Itachi is like the best brother ever. I won't believe it! Wait, but... Naruto says believe it, so it must be true. He's a criminal. He slaughtered our clan. I can't believe it. Oh, Sasuke. Datebayo. <laughs> that was part of Itachi's plan as well. Become an Akatsuki, then spy on the organization from the inside. Even after betraying his clan and leaving, Itachi's heart lay with a hidden leaf. And most of all, with you. It isn't a lie. Holy shit. I thought more of you then. Stop it! It's all a bit. Joke's on you, You're Sasuke. Itachi was best boy all along. As a result, your eyes didn't see through Itachi at all. Itachi killed his friends, his superiors. His lover, his father, and his mother. But his little brother alone, he could not kill. This is the real killing joke. This this is Sasuke's one bad day. <laughs> he killed all of his own emotions. Save for crying tears of blood and slaughtered his own flesh and blood. But he just couldn't bring himself to kill you. Do you understand what that means? To him. Your life was more precious than even the village. Until the very moment of his death. No, even after he died, by allowing you to defeat him, he achieved revenge against the Uchiha clan by making you out to be the, the leaf ultimate hero. fuck you to the Uchiha. Ravaged by illness. Painfully aware of his oh, life. yeah, and I guess he was sick. He forcefully prolonged his life with medication. Search your feelings. You know it to be true. He had to fight you and die in front of you. For the peace of the Hidden Leaf Village. 
I mean, yeah, I, I guess Itachi was just... He Anakined his entire village, but, like, for a good reason. He desired to die a criminal and a traitor. I mean, he still killed children, I assume. Disgrace in the place of honor and hate in the place of love. God, could you imagine Itachi just killing the entire village? Walks into a house, just stabs a baby in a cradle. Yeah, he's a good guy. <laughs> he did. He stabbed that baby to prevent war. And Itachi still died with a smile on his face. He bequeathed to you the Uchiha name, still fooling you to the very end. Is the truth behind Itachi Uchiha. Madara killed the women and children? <laughs> oh god. So Itachi was just like, okay, I'll, I'll do these guys. Uh, I, I'd i feel bad if you if I did this. Could you do that for me? <laughs> that is how your brother lived. Okay, so Itachi did all the hard stuff. Alright. I'm going to kill all the people that are difficult to kill. And you, Madara... You, you kill all the people who can't fight or defend themselves at all. Does that sound fair? <laughs> Big brother. What's wrong, Sasuke? What do you mean, what's wrong? Today is the day you promised to check my shuriken jutsu, isn't it? God, imagine the timeline where Sasuke's dad did become Sorry. Hokage. I have an important mission tomorrow. I have to study, so... You're a liar. <sighs> Sorry, Sasuke. Maybe next oh, time. I see I see the forehead flick. <laughs> so to make up for it, I have to piggyback you? Man. Hey, big brother. You're gonna help me with my training next time for real, right? I will. I mean, in the, in the end, Itachi did help Sasuke with his training. Sasuke became one hell of a ninja thanks to Itachi. As long as we can be together once in a while. Then it's okay. Sasuke. You are. Sasuke, this is it. Ten, this that was only ten episodes. We are no longer the heavy. Dang. From this day on, our team will be the hawk. We are the Taka. I know that Taka is hawk Taka because of Common Rider O's. One motive. We exist to destroy the Hidden Leaf Village. What? <laughs> Hey, you know how Itachi wanted to protect the Hidden Leaf Village in order to prevent ninja war? Ah, fuck that. <laughs> the hawk screamed. Just once, into the void. Itachi went from most loved it bad boy to most loved good voice. boy in ten episodes. Dang. An empty voice. And... A 
voice full of rage. Oh shit. The boy who bore the Sasuke is the band of the hawk. <laughs> this can only now go poorly. Turns a lethal knife is Madara gonna do his own version of the eclipse now? God, that would be fucked up. Rises on war. The revenge of truth, a reckoning of the past. Mourning for his dead brother in his heart. The tale of a new Sasuke Uchiha. Sasuke's being Begins dumb here, but uh, now. he's the emotional capacity of a 16-year-old and hates the clan forced to sacrifice of his brother. Nah, I get it. <laughs> Brothers. Done. <laughs> No, no, I, I completely get it. I completely get that the Hidden Leaf Village were kind of the assholes in this situation. But, like... The whole preventing ninja war thing would kind of weigh on me. <laughs> Mind you, I'm like 28, so... Hey, Jonathan King. Hope you're doing well. Pain. He's here. Yo, she cute, though. And Sasuke, he looked well. He had ample control over the power of the Sharingan. The time is ripe. The Hidden Leaf Village should also start to act soon. Don't think about it, I'll get a paper what cut. The nine tails? Did I pull any new units? Yeah, uh, I actually, <laughs> in, a, uh, in a ticket pull, like a, a rainbow ticket pull. I got Pal uh, Paladin Sylvie, so... I've got both of the anniversary units now. And I got her to EX plus one, so I'm happy. Take him down with Konan. How about you? Do not fail. Understood. Be on your guard just in case. Naruto Uzumaki. He is no longer just a boy. And now he has rather considerable jutsu. As well as many comrades. It won't be easy. It's useless telling us to fear our target. EX2 Chizuru. Nice. Pain I tried pulling for lost. her, but I, I wasn't able to get her. <laughs> well, I'm focusing on trying to get both true. of the mech units, because I absolutely love them. I've already got Rus. I just need to get the other one. Chapter 6, The Tale of Jiraiya the Gallant. You mean... He... J Jiraiya does not strike me as gallant. Hey, Tsunade. Oh, Jiraiya. This is unusual. You never visit out of the blue... 9k place. attack? Holy... Wow! <laughs> Jeez! Well, I've got my hands on some unusual the The only character that I have that gets to 9k attack is my EX1 id in trance mode. <laughs> Unusual information? Brace yourself. We've located the leader of the Akatsuki. You, you what? Is that true? He's you a ronin? Just, tell me everything. I mean, I, d I don't think I've seen him in a headband. He's He's and got that kind of faceplate thing going on. I see. The Hidden Rain Village, huh? Ah, uh, yes. The different levels in Naruto. Genin, Chunin, Ronin. <laughs> right. The head of the Akatsuki is somewhat revered there. They call him Pain. That's a very reclusive village. Investigating this won't be easy. Yeah, that's why I've got to go in alone first to investigate. Uh, Nani the fuck, Jiraiya? It's too dangerous. Hey, relax, will ya? This is me we're talking about. Jiraiya, one of the legendary Sanin. Remember? Oh yeah, Sanin too. But I'm the only shinobi in this village who can get in and out of there in one piece with the info we need. All right. So I'm going to level with you guys. I know Jiraiya dies. I I was on the internet when it happened and people were very sad. I just don't know how it happens. 
So with, with him going into the into the enemy compound alone, that kind of raises some death flags for me. Jiraiya, just come back alive. If I lost you too, I. <laughs> what? Are you gonna cry? Ah, oh, that makes my day. Look for fly. I mean, that that one guy earlier with the wind magic and whatnot. He had a lot of death flags too, so. Hush, you fool. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I won't die so easily. Relax. Hey, look at that! A big old death flag hanging out. Just hey, what does that say on your uh, on in front of your desk, Tsunade? Oh, that ju that just says death. Why? Oh, no reason. That's a cool flag. Can I have it? Hey, Jiraiya, what's your favorite show? Oh, I don't know. Our flag means death? Jiraiya. See you. Tsunade. Also, they didn't show his face this entire time. For the Hidden Rain Village. I guess that means I go to Tenshi Bridge first. All right, let's go. In Japanese, FFB, they're doing a NeoVision CG Cloud from Remake. Nice. Like a new one? I I know that I have a FF7 Remake Cloud, but uh, having a new one would be fantastic. Now that they've announced Remake 2. God, we we really need to beat Final Fantasy 7 Remake, don't we? I might be a bit too busy to do it for the stream. But maybe maybe I'll try and actually beat it before it uh, like part two comes out. Hey Sakura. You're a character I know, I'll talk to you. I should probably hang out at the bird box. CG Yuffie? Oh, dang. I... God, I really need to get Yuffie. Wh whenever they bring her over, I need to get her. What? My, my friend Kyle. He showed me... I'll, I'll show you guys. Uh, the original portrait of Yuffie from uh, Final Fantasy 7. Is the absolute best. Because it looks like she doesn't want to be there. It it looks it looks like she's holding in a poop. <laughs> like <laughs> Our our girl Yuffie isn't doing so great in that in that portrait. She <laughs> She has something to hide. <laughs> it, it, it's like, hey, Yuffie, you want to go for food? We were, we were thinking like, uh, I don't know, McDonald's. She's like, yeah, sure, I'd, I'd love McDonald's. That's fine. <laughs> Can't play the DLC? Don't have a PC or PS5? Aw oh, man, I was considering playing the DLC on stream. Just because I, I do have a PS5, so that would make it so people who don't would be able to experience it. But we never got around to it, we never beat Final Fantasy VII Remake. So, you know, if that's something that pops up, if uh, that people want me to do, to play the Intergrade DLC, I'll, uh, I'll throw it up on the next Patreon poll.
pretty sure You're absolutely right though, RDF. <laughs> That's exactly what she looks like. Maybe I'll take a little side trip. Okay. <laughs> this takes me back. Saying for the near banner? I was thinking about it. Because the near banner would be really good. And, you know, it's a limited unit, so it's not like I'm going to be able to pull for it later. Long, but but I really long. like the uh, the mech units. I, I'm a big fan of mech anime. I've, I've even got, like, a Gurren Lagan tattoo, so... <laughs> you did well to make it through without giving up. The words give up don't exist. Maybe I'll world. also throw Nier Automata on the uh, next Patreon poll, too. I'd love to play that on stream. <laughs> I played through most of the endings. I think I only had two left before I uh, moved on to other games. You do, Avarus? Yeah. I, I was really happy when I pulled him. In that case, let me test you to see what At the very really least, I got one of them. I, I want both, though. Huh? Is that today's training? Yes, it isn't anything complicated. It's a yeah, Nier's coming to switch. To your progress so far. The end of Yorha edition. I'm I'm glad that people are going to be able to uh, enjoy that. An all-out battle, you versus me. Show me everything. There was a time when I thought that like, oh man, having things exclusive to one system is really cool. So that means people will play on the thing that I like. But like. If I like a game, I want people to be able to play it, right? That's why I'm really happy that Persona 5 is coming to uh, Switch and PC and Xbox pretty soon. Persona 5 is one of those games that I don't think we're ever going to play on stream. Because when I get into Persona, I really get into it. I tried streaming Persona 4, and we only got up to Rise. And I cancel it because people... I, I have a lot of, like, zero viewer streams, so I didn't think people were into it. Maybe we'll pick it up again, though. What I've got, huh? Dry as a perv, but there's a scene. Although filler, where he turns down a princess begging marriage because he was waiting for Tsunade to be ready for love again. Ah, That's the thing. You can be a perv, but also, like, believe in true love. Th those aren't mutually exclusive. Yeah, the Crisis Core remaster, too. This time, though, I'll be fighting for God, I remember playing that on PSP on the bus ride to high school. That and Dissidia. Don't get scared when you see what I've really got. That a boy. All right, then. Let's go. Here I come, Pervy Sage. Now then, let's see how he's doing. Oh, we're in a flashback fight. All right. God, look at that smile. Look, look at Jiraiya's portrait behind the uh, the bowel conditions. That's a good face. Oh no, he's using my trick against me! I used to do that a lot. Hi. God, I suck at hitting with that, don't I? You haven't tried any Persona? Uh, I highly recommend starting with 5, actually. It's a self-contained story, and it's, uh, it's the most recent. So the mechanics aren't gonna be, like, as stale as the older ones. Because I find that, mechanically, Persona 4 and Persona 3 kinda... I mean, they're good games and all, but they're not really welcoming for people who are beginning. Persona's really interesting, because, like, 
personal opinion, but menu-based combat is incredibly dated, and I, I really feel like action-based combat is going to replace it in a lot of different RPGs. But Persona is one where, because they kind of... They made the menu-based mechanics fun, because they had a little bit of a gimmick to it. God, I, I want to get Jiraiya's ultimate jutsu off at some point. Love the losing flashback fights. Oops, that, that's not how that went. Uh, let, let's try that again. I'm misremembering this. I'm the one who won this fight. Oh, that's unblockable, huh? Hi. We'll call that one a stalemate. There we go. Now I won't try that again. Uh oh. <laughs> uh oh! You love Pokemon with all your heart? No, that's fair. But I think even Pokemon had to uh, adjust it, right? Where the menu-based mechanics in Pokemon Legends Arceus really felt like they they evolved. Like being able to switch Pokemon on the fly, uh, according to the situation, not having a set turn order, but having it done just with uh, your speed versus the opponents. I, I feel like they evolved the system and made it more fun in Legends. And again, Pokemon Legends leans more towards action now. Think they will remaster the stadium games? That would be really cool. I don't know if they would, though. I I would really like a remaster of 1 and 2, though. J if only for the minigames. We, uh, got early on when I was streaming. I used to do Saturday morning retro streams. And one of the games that we played was Pokemon Stadium. But only the mini games. And I, I love that stream with all my heart. God, I should actually focus on what's going on, shouldn't I? Not good with dry, am I? <laughs> also, Naruto hasn't tried to use his ultimate on me yet. I'm kind of worried about that. I'm gonna eat some noodles now. Noodles did nothing. I, I thought noodles healed. God, he can continue the combo? What? Final Fantasy 1 to 6 pixels would come to Switch? Yeah, that would be great. Honestly, I think that they're built for the Switch. Because, like, I would love to play those on the go. Oh. 
All right, so do I not know how the, uh, the, sorry, the perfect block mechanic works? Or is it just that finicky? I, I feel like I'm the one who's wrong here. play one through six? Which ones did I play? I played Final Fantasy one, I played Final Fantasy three, four, I didn't play five, and I haven't played six yet. Oh, you still have some energy left. I can't, I can't let you do that, Naruto. I've lost too many times. You're Four and six are amazing? Mind. I... I have some love for Final Fantasy 1. It's cute. Final Fantasy 4 is 31 years old? Yeah! It's crazy to think about, isn't it? He's got some weak points, but he's definitely grown strong. There were your first Final Fantasy games? You were hooked? Which ones are mine? I didn't play Final Fantasy on the Super Nintendo, otherwise I would have played 6. Uh, I didn't have a PlayStation growing up, so I didn't play Final Fantasy 7 or 8. Uh, or 9. I didn't play Final Fantasy 10, because I believe that was on PS2. I didn't play Final... Well, I tried to play Final Fantasy 11, but I wasn't actually able to use my dad's credit card. Uh, let's see. I didn't play Final Fantasy XII. I know I... No, you know what? I think my first Final Fantasy game was Final Fantasy VII on PSP. But that was, like, the the first mainline Final Fantasy game that I played. Or was it? No, I think, actually, I got Final Fantasy One on UMD on my PSP. And I think Final Fantasy One. Oddly enough, was my first Final Fantasy game. I know I had Crystal Chronicles, uh, My Life as a King, if that counts. God, what was my first Final Fantasy game? Tact uh, Tactics was your first? And yeah, that was on Game Boy, wasn't it? Well, not not Game Boy, Game Boy, but Game Boy Advance. Think they'll remaster Dirge of Cerberus? I hope so. It was a weird game, but like I think people still like Vincent, so. Burby Saint, come on, one more match. No, that's enough. I got a good idea of your strength. I can still fight. I don't want to quit when I'm down. Burby Saint. <laughs> What? What are you laughing for? Well, it looks like that got passed on as well. Huh? What are you talking about? No, nothing. Just I'm also one of the myself. few people that really liked Final Fantasy XIII. What? Maybe it's because I wasn't incredibly well acquainted with the Final Fantasy format. But, like, having it be more linear, I thought it was fine. I liked the characters... Maybe, maybe Vanille a little bit less. She got kind of grating. His eyes just then. And and, and Noah was kind of a douchebag. I mean, not Noah. Hope. Who am I thinking of? Who's Noah? I swear, he's just like his father. But like Fang was endearing. I really liked Lightning as a protagonist too. Her sword was really cool. The Blaze Fire Saber, I think, is my favorite Final Fantasy weapon. All right, we should get moving again. A apparently, I like the Final Fantasy games that people don't like because I like 15 and I like 13. I also really enjoy 14, but I I can't for the life of me justify paying a $17 subscription. Not 
much further to Tenshi Bridge. Finally. You like 15? That's good. I I'm glad someone else likes 15. Because I hear a lot of hate for it. But you know what? I love the boy band's dynamic. I love being able to drive a car. Oddly enough, I really enjoy the modern aspects of uh, Final Fantasy. And a lot of people really want it to go back to basics. And Final Fantasy 16 looks like it's going to go there. And it's going to be really fun. I'm excited for Final Fantasy 16. We'll probably stream that one. Four, six, seven, nine, ten, twelve, fifteen are your jam. I can agree with that. I will say again, I I never got out of Midgar in Final Fantasy VII. I really enjoyed Final Fantasy IX though. I I feel like Zidane and the entire crew were were just really fun. here and I know people will say weird things if I say that I really liked Freya Crescent but you know what Freya was good too I liked Freya Crescent sue me so close to game three yep I'll be, I'll be completely honest, I really, really want to finish this game, like this series of games, before I move. Or sorry, not, not just before I move, before I start school. Because I'm gonna have to cut all of the day streams when I start. So the sooner we finish Naruto, the better. Because <laughs> then I can move Tokyo Mirage Sessions to evenings on Mondays. Let's. What is it, Pain? Someone is obstructing my ray. Class starts on the 19th the of September, though, so we have plenty of time. He's an expert. What should we do? You shouldn't even need to ask. So what's Conan's deal? Besides the origami thing. It was hard to get into. It came out so fast after 7, the storyline sucked, but they wanted to come out with something beautifully animated. The spell system killed you. Having to grind on stealing spells was so annoying. Oof. The old Final Fantasy anime. Dang. All who hinder me shall be wiped out. There is nothing else. I didn't know that there was one. I, I know that there was a Fire Emblem OVA. That was one of the anime bomb episodes that never got released. Right. I'll go make Preparations. I leave the rest up to you, Conan. Of course. Okay, so she she's got author can't write women syndrome. I get ya. Right. Infiltration complete. The hidden rain village. Hmm. I can't help but remember those kids. That was back during the Second Great Ninja War, when there was still no end in sight. Try, Totter? Okay. They were orphans of the Third Great Ninja War? Dang. And they're the Akatsuki, so they have to die, right? Is neck pain a common thing for animators or, uh, and artists? Actually, yes. Uh, along with stretching your wrists... Uh, before you start on a project. Uh, you should also do some neck exercises as well. Uh, just because, like, it's not necessarily repetitive motion, but having your neck in one place all the time at an angle looking down isn't so great for your neck. Tsunade and I and Orochimaru, we fought against the Hidden Rain Village, and that's where I met them. Those three. The second? Okay. 
That's what he said, at least. Orphaned by the war, I felt sorry for them, so I decided to look after them until they could stand on their own two feet. Cool guy, Jiraiya. We lived under the same roof, shared a brief peace together. Even in the hidden rain, where the shadow of war still fell, those kids grew strong and sturdy, little by little. Uh, looking back on those days now, I realize just how much they meant to me. A few years later, Look at the kids. they made names for themselves in several battles. But then, I heard rumors okay. that they died. Well, that's how the world works. There's no avoiding it. But still, it breaks your heart. Jiraiya has the biggest single dad energy. Uh-oh. Mustn't do that. This is no time to get lost in memories. I've got a job to do. If I go back empty-handed, Tsunade will never let me live it down. Nor those three. All right. Guess I'll start. Hey, Radiance. You found something awesome. What'd you find? Oh, I should probably save, actually. Oh, it's not gonna let me. Kids have it easy with their Greg universe. Naruto hit kids had to deal with Jiraiya. No, I don't have to find him. I, I need to go back to the birdhouse. Oh, there's people here now. Great. Hi. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Radiance. Uh, Nightbot blocks links, so give me one sec. I will open the links for you in one sec. Uh, do, 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 do. All right, you're good now. Oh, Radiance, go ahead. Uh, I I opened up the Links and Nightbot, so. There we go. I'm just going to put the block back on and we'll watch it. Okay, give me one sec. Follow me if you would like to survive. Why? Is it a call to action and a motivation for that action all in one night? Like traffic. No, I mean, why are you here? Feel not, my radical compadre. I think you're gonna like me. Dare you use my nostalgia against me to feed my addiction? Are these VHS dice handcrafted? <laughs> Fucking excuse me? So many people with these. Whoa! I meant emotionally. That is not in any way, shape, or form better, bud. And these are mine now. If you want your own, you gotta go to the Kickstarter by 1985 Games. You've only got like 48 hours left, so hurry. Then we have to go now! How did you- Quickly! Get to the Kickstarter! That's not even the right movie! Follow me if you would like to survive. Okay, I kinda want some VHS dice now. God, we... Okay. So, I put in my resignation at, to uh, at the toy store. And, uh... One thing that I'm not gonna miss... Is the fact that some of the new hires that we have make me feel like I'm crumbling to dust. Uh... We were talking to one of them, and we were talking about, like, Ah, oh, you know, there was something on VHS. And the guy's like, what's a VHS? I'm like... It... You, you watch movies on it. Like a DVD? No, a VHS. <laughs> oh, 
And 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 then I realized that all we are is dust in the wind. Yeah, it it looks like uh the Kickstarter's still up. I might have to contribute some money to it. You saw on Twitter? Yeah. You wish you had given one of your previous bosses that Lester. Uh sorry, that letter so desperately? Yeah. This facility is awfully suspicious. What on earth is waiting in store for me? Well, I'll just have to keep going. Now then, how will this go? I am sneaking through Rain Village. Hope these guys cannot see me. Put the link in stream context. Fantastic, thanks Radiance. This one you have, to God, you guys remember renting a video and like, always remembering to rewind it because you got one that wasn't rewound. It's like, oh no, I've been betrayed by the last person mm -hmm. that borrowed this. When did the rain stop? Can't, you can't be the hidden rain village without the hidden rain. Chef kiss for the letter? Hell yeah. Get some for yourself as well. I hope you enjoy them. Uh, cut from this game, but Jiraiya swoons a MILF hotel owner with his charisma to learn about... Oh, there's the cat. <laughs> to learn about pain before the fight. Oh, hell yeah. As part of his inter uh, intel gathering. Okay, good to know. You had a rewinder device so you didn't have to rewind the VHS? That's good. Every time we finish watching a movie from, like, our local rental store, A Plus Video, uh, we'd be like, okay, movie's done. Hit the rewind button, go do something else until it was rewound. The end of the rain marks the beginning of our fight. That voice. It's time for God's punishment to descend on the unworthy. Yeah, well, I've got God's blessing on this wonderful world. <laughs> this takes me back. I was just thinking about you. However, I never thought we'd be reunited under these circumstances. Conan. That little flower in her hair is so cute. I, I always like it when... Like, I, I like the flower and the hair aesthetic. You've really blossomed since I last saw you. Oh, Jiraiya, don't say it like that. We know what you write. What does a villager of the Leaf want here? I'm investigating the leader of the Akatsuki. Imagine my surprise running into you. Does that mean that Pain is either Yahiko or Nagato? Knowing that would be meaningless. Your life is just going to end here. I'll have Carson sing a thing. All right. What's a, what's a thing I can sing? All right. I don't promise I'll do this well, but... That's the wrong one. Since we are playing Naruto.
We are fighting dreamers. Takami wo mezashite fighting dreamers. Nari furikama wazu fighting dreamers. Shinjiru gama mani ori 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 oh just go my right here right now bang pupanasa like a dangan rhino right here right now butagita kuza get the fire right here right now boom panasa like a dangan rhino right here right now burn Kewashi shura no michi no naka hito no chizu wo hiro gete doko e yuku shit koko asi shoko God, I cannot do this one, sorry. No, I fucked that one up. How about... I tried my best. I just... God, rapping in Japanese was hard enough. Now we got the big words. Uh, how about... How about something from Guilty Gear, like... Let's see if it'll let me do this one. Because they just released information that I think in a couple of weeks the new Guilty Gear season comes out. So we'll be going back to Guilty Gear pretty soon. It's not evil or sacred, it's just life. He just doesn't defy the gravity of something. Life, life, it's drawn to each other, ubiquity. Life, life, she doesn't need a name to distinguish him. Oh, she flies through the proud darkness Rather than the breathless vastness of the world And yet, he did not reject the light herself He believes she's one of a chain It's no exception, it's just less. I guess you can't trust a gentle tiger. Life, life, it's drawn to each other, ubiquity. Life, life, he doesn't need a name to distinguish her. Rulers are afraid of the wind For the rustling of the trees would take the night from them Oh, he flies to be the wings of the flightless fly high to be seen from everywhere She just tells them he's there without whispering He believes that she's one of a chain Here's the instrumental break. It's gonna be a long one. Daisuke really likes his guitar. Can't wait for me to play Kakarot so he can hear me scream Frieza. Oh god, that would hurt. Oh, he flies through the proud darkness rather than 
the breathless vastness of the world. And yet, she did not reject the light himself. She believes that he's she flies at night to see the sun of tomorrow. He never wanted to have a special day. She just wants it to be there like a weed, naturally, as a matter of course. He believes. We are one of a chain. She believes we are one. When's Bridget coming out for Guilty Gear? Give me one sec. Alright. We're gonna be going back to Guilty Gear. Do, 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 do. God, come on, article, please tell me. Wait. Wait. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Guys, we we might we might be going back to Guilty Gear sooner than I thought. <laughs> I I thought it was far away from now, but God, where where are you, Guilty Gear? I didn't I didn't delete Guilty Gear. I know that. Guilty Gear Strive. Yeah. I don't think... Maybe I didn't tell this story. Okay, there's Season Pass 2. Give me one sec. Okay, so, yeah... Tonight's stream is gonna go a bit long. Okay, so the story the story behind Okay, I'm I'm actually gonna make a poll for this one. The story while I do that, I'll tell the story. The story behind me getting a PS5 was actually kind of exciting. So essentially, I wanted a PS5 on day one, because I had the money, and you know what? The PS5 looks really stupid. And when they redesign it, it's not going to look as dumb. So I wanted the stupid-looking PS5. I want the game system that looks like a modern art sculpture that a city would pay $8 million for to hire an artist that just does it for the fact that they make $8 million out of it. Right? Uh, so I go to the GameStop website, and I get all the way to... There we go. I get all the way to the part where I, uh, I have to put in my address. And I put in my address, and it doesn't let me check out. They're sold out. You know what? That's fine. I, I can wait for a PS5, whatever. A month goes by. I want this game called 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. So I go on the GameStop website, I throw in my cart, and realize there's two things in my cart. One of them is 13 Sentinels Aegis Rim. The other thing in my cart is the PlayStation 5. And it says that it's in stock. So being an enterprising individual, I'm like, okay, you know what? 
what if I go through with this? The worst thing that can happen is that it doesn't let me go through. So I go through with the purchase, and I put in my... Sorry, the cat's on top of my bookshelf. Uh, I put in my information, and it lets me check out. And I'm like, okay, you know what? In, in a little bit, I'm going to get an email saying that I'm not allowed to have this PlayStation 5. I'm sorry, we're refunding your money. And I completely get that. But the, the email doesn't come. And the email doesn't come. And then November comes. You know what else comes? My PlayStation 5 in the mail. And yeah, that's how I tripped and fell my way into, uh, into getting a PS5. There we go. I just want to go through the arcade mode of, uh, for Bridget. So if you guys want to see me do that, we can do that tonight. We can do that right now. If you want to vote, just put a number in the chat, one or two. So envious. You want one so bad? Yeah. I, I can imagine. The PlayStation 5 is really hard to come by right now, and I, I got really lucky. I got stupid lucky. All right. It looks like both people in chat are saying on a different stream. Anyone else in the audience, if you want to vote on it, go for it. Otherwise, I will accept these results. I'll give you until it says two minutes. Okay, well, that's... that's two minutes. Sorry, my cat was playing with my microphone cord, and, uh, that's a no-go, so I got the spray bottle ready. I got it pointed at her right now. Alright, well, we, we'll probably be playing Guilty Gear on Wednesday. <laughs> if that's the case, uh... Well, well, listen to you. We are no longer on your side. Our wishes and ideas aren't what they were before, Jiraiya Sensei. I mean, we haven't started this fight yet, and it's a straight walk to her from the, uh... From the birdhouse. So, uh... Alright. We'll end it here. Thanks so much, everyone, for hanging out! Uh... I'll be back on Wednesday. Uh... I, I guess on the docket for Wednesday is, uh... I'll start the stream a little bit early at, like, 11 a.m. Uh, Pacific time. Am I- am I audible? Hello? 
Okay, we good. My my cat just broke my ring light. Uh and and knocked out everything. So uh Yeah. How about that? So uh We got that going for us. So I'll figure out how to fix that. And then okay, so for reals this time, Wednesday morning, we're gonna start at about 11 a.m. Pacific time, and uh, we're gonna play through Bridget's uh, arcade mode in Guilty Gear, and then we're gonna go into Tokyo Mirage Sessions Sharp FE. Maybe if I uh, if I'm able to beat Bridget's arcade mode fast enough, um, then the Wednesday evening stream might be a bit delayed because I'm going to be a guest on another stream at probably around 6 p.m. Pacific. Uh, I'll give you guys more details as they come. But essentially, you guys get like three streams with uh, featuring Carson. So yeah, I'll chat about that soon. Friday is the watch party on Discord, so get hyped for that. Uh, yeah, I believe we only have take a look. One, two, three. We got like four episodes of Revise left, so that's going to be a blast. Plus, we're going to have to watch Kamen Rider O's really fast now because the Kamen Rider Double anime is out and we got to watch Kamen Rider Double. Uh, Saturday, we're going back to Stream Sakai. I've got something new to share. Some possible cool new stuff. For, uh, for Stream Sakai that my patrons and my subscribers know about, but I'm not talking about to uh, everyone else just yet. And on Sunday, we're going to play Ace Attorney with the crew, as usual. We're going to find out what Yoshikage Kira wants with uh, Phoenix Wright. Anyways, I'm going to go fix my ring light. God, it's blinding right now. Who am I going to send you to? I'm pretty sure Thero is streaming right now. Yeah, I'll send you folks to Theropod Art. If you guys don't know who Thero... Oh, Thero's playing Final Fantasy XIV? Hell yeah. If you guys don't know who Thero is, Theropod is a dinosaur VTuber. Uh, he usually draws stuff on the stream uh, and listens to the Unexpectables podcast. Right now, he's playing Final Fantasy XIV, so give him a big old shark attack, and I'll catch you guys later. See ya!